fall in love. Lose our minds, don't be in charge of anything. Let tell break loose. Quality time for you and I. Don't let this time just pass us by. You know I'll cry, and I know you will too. Wrap my heart with silver and clover. Take my hand, give me your shoulder. Don't make me wait, or I'll make a move. Let love wash away all the fears we had in the past. I won't lose my. I will serve and protect your heart. Please don't make me wait to love or love. I lose our minds. Stick around. Let's fall in love. Fall in love, lose our minds, don't be in charge of anything. Let our break loose. Quality time for you and I. Don't let this time just pass us by. You know I'll cry, and I know you will too. Wrap my heart with silver and clover. Take my hand, give me your shoulder. Don't make me wait, or I'll make a move. Let love wash away all the fears we had in the past. I want. Your heart, please don't make me wait to love or love and lose our minds. Stick around, let's fall in love. Absolutely beautiful performance by Ian Musani and the band. I loved it. I hope you enjoyed and you loved that song. And there are going to be three more. Uh, sets of songs coming right away. I hope you're enjoying the show. This is the Power Talk Show with me, Dominic. It's another Wednesday with me and we are having another beautiful conversation, living with this ability. And my guest today is Anthony Moretti, the team leader at Safaricom Call Center. She'll, he'll be, not, not she, he will be talking to us. You know, we'll be listening, having this beautiful conversation. And I want you to be part of this conversation by going to our social media pages, Instagram, that is Y254 underscore channel, uh, Twitter, Y254 channel, and most of all, go to Facebook page, Y254, and talk to us. You know, there'll be a poster there. There'll be a post there talking, you know, with this conversation. And I want you to be part of this conversation, suggest opinion uh, or comment about what you think about the show, what you want to, uh, maybe you want to ask a question to my guest, Anthony Moredi, or you want to pass a comment to our guest band today, Ian Musani and the band, they'll be performing and they've got some great music lined up for you. And so today we are focusing on living with this ability. And we are talking, we are, we are focusing on people living with different kind of disability, but particularly physical disability today. And uh, I know, I, I, I can imagine what it is to have a family member or yourself uh, living with a particular form of disability, could be mental, could be, uh, could be physical, could be any other kind of disability. And we need to build this culture of inclusivity. It can be difficult when you feel rejected, when you don't feel part of the community. So there needs to be a two-way movement here from you as an individual who is going through this uh, living with disability 
believing that there is something greater for yourself that just because you have a disability does not mean that your life has ended there and you need to communicate this to the people you care about the people that you love the people who are in your circle who by your words of encouragement who are living this kind of disability you can communicate to them so it's a movement of those who are living with disability feeling you know i matter that I am enough, that my disability is not the end of my life. And for those of us who are uh, part of the community that these people live in, we can communicate love and acceptance and inclusivity, and it's our job to do so. So text me in and be part of this conversation, and uh, I hope you'll enjoy the music coming from Ian Musani. Ian, how are you, man? I mean, it's nice to have you on the show. Thank you so much. Now, I'm so happy to be here. You're perfect. Now, yeah. you're, the two gentlemen don't have mics with them. Maybe you can introduce them to us. Uh, on on my right, left, I have a... <laughs> <laughs> not to worry, not to worry. It's okay, it's yeah. allowed. Uh -huh. On my left, I have Timo, uh -huh. or Tim Zikituro. He's okay. a bassist from... We work in the same band. It's called Saweri. Saweri so uh -huh. Timo plays bass uh -huh. in our band. And uh -huh. we have Baraka. Baraka. He plays sax. Uh -huh. uh, we're in the same band and we get to work together. Absolutely. And that's Ian Sani. Ian Musani, yeah. and you, the music you have is great. Like the song you just performed, mm -hmm. it's, a, it's an amazing song. I loved Thank it. So I was much. I was on cloud nine listening yeah. to that piece of music. Thank you. I'm so happy. On composition? On composition, uh, we strictly do our own songs. Oh, wow. Yeah. So everything you're going to hear tonight, mm -hmm. it's our own. And I'm sure our viewers yeah. are going to enjoy what you're going to be singing today. I hope so. Should, will they expect to hear something new? Do you have something new coming? Yeah, of course, some... your music is new to most of us. It's true. But I know maybe you have something also maybe in yeah, the Yeah, I have a new song mm -hmm. that I released like four days ago mm -hmm. it's called Nasema Leo it's a wedding song people can go out and check it out on YouTube it's mm -hmm. out on YouTube just search Nasema Leo by Ian Sani yeah. yeah that's on YouTube you said yeah that's on YouTube uh, what about Instagram Twitter Facebook? Instagram um, Ian Sani uh-huh Everywhere, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, everywhere. Ian, Ian Sunny. Sunny. That's yeah. amazing. I mean, so you've got some great music Thank and I so can't much. wait to hear your next song, please. Thank you. Do it. This one is called Mama Pete's also out on YouTube. Oh, perfect. Yeah. All right. Shafika kusorora Patisha anza na viona Maobu wako sete kwenye kona Juleo anajua ni kupona na Mababi wame black imenu kundani Na maobu wako sete kuwa chunadi Itabidi hima ya adu mecheza kwa ni kama we Pita na we We ikini bamba pia Lewi na kubamba ikini bamba pia Na we we ikini bamba pia Lewi na kubamba ikini bamba nita pita na we Ikini bamba pia Lewi na kubamba ikini bamba pia Na wewe ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba It's on a Friday night Umeanza kupati Drinks ina come to na mshika Kiku check my right Kade mkako fantastic Changa mkia yo men Mrs. Lady Namba si dada chiza tunami Misi worry about a thing Juku kona ami Suna juwa hima yad Mindi kusema kwa ni papa yao A looking fresh and clean Mini msafi sana Tama fans wana juwa hini Moto sana Cheza ligi so siyo ju Anibana Pita na we Ikini bamba pia, lewi na kubamba ikini bamba pia Na wewe ikini bamba pia, lewi na kubamba ikini bamba nita pita Na wewe ikini bamba pia, lewi na kubamba ikini bamba pia Na wewe ikini bamba pia, ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba pia, ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba, nasema leo nitapona Anacheki kadem kwenye kona Asha ni bamba, ata akiringa Leo ni japona, anacheki kadem kwenye kona Asha ni bamba, ata akiringa Nita pita na ye, ye ye Pita na ye, ye 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 Pita na ye, ye ye Pita na ye, ye 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 Nita pita na we, we ikini bamba pia Leo ina kubamba ikini bamba pia Na we Bamba pia, leo ina kubamba ikini bamba nita pita na we We ikini bamba pia, leo ina kubamba ikini bamba pia Na we, we ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba pia, ikini bamba pia
Ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba pia Ikini bamba Ikini bamba you know, one of the things that I love about this show is the guests that I that come to my show and also the entertainment that comes on my show. The performance is always great. And today, as you can hear from uh, Msani, uh, Ian Msani, he has some great music, man. I mean, I love so that much. also. And Thank you. Well, okay, we'll, I'll come back to you. It's so, okay. ladies and gentlemen, today we're talking about living with these abilities, as I mentioned to you. And I want you to go to our Facebook page, uh, White 254, and, uh, and comment on the, on, the, on the post there. What do you, you know, suggestion, opinion, or question to my guest, Anthony Moradi? And I told you, Anthony Moradi is the team leader at Safaricom Call Center. And I think he's the voice. He'll be telling us that he, if he is that voice. And as I mentioned to you, you can also go to our Instagram uh, page, white254 underscore channel, or Twitter, white254 channel. We, uh, we are going to be sampling your comments, your questions, and suggestions. So go there and be part of this conversation. And you can go also go to Anthony Muredi's page and see some of the pictures there. We'll also be scanning through them and having this conversation with you. So be part of this conversation. You can also go to my own Facebook page at I am Kamau Mwangi and I'll be also be reading your comments. Welcome, Bon Anthony, to the show, man. Thank you so much. It's nice to have you here. I'm happy. Once again. Uh, Asante, son. I, I think you were here in 2017. 2017, yes. 2017. Yes. And we, we didn't have a very long conversation then because of other technical yes. issues. Sure. But now you're here. Finally. Finally. I'm here again. Man, it's good, it's good to have you. It's good to be here again. Maybe, uh, you know, I've already introduced you as Anthony Moredi, but you want to tell us a little bit more of who Anthony Moredi is? Um, uh, Moredi, Anthony, or Anthony Moredi, mm. uh, is a first born in a family of seven. Uh -huh. uh, yes, I'm the first born in a family of seven. So you had to be a deputy president quickly. <laughs> a, a deputy parent. A, a, a deputy parent. Chap, chap. Marahio. And uh, uh, I was born in, back in Embu. Mm -hmm. uh, but I schooled in Thika and Kikuyu. Uh, well, that's a Joy Town Special Primary School mm -hmm. for the Physically Handicapped. Mm -hmm. And also uh, Alliance High School, Kikuyu. Also, also Alliance High School. Yes. What, 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 were you born this way? Uh, no. Physically challenged? No, I wasn't born this way. I was born uh, uh, what we may call a normal child. Or mm -hmm. I was working mm -hmm. until the age of two. But at the age of two, I contracted polio. And that uh, left me in the state that I am in. So the, physically, the physical challenge that you have right now is because of polio? Yes, it's polio. Yeah, now, usually they say there's a vaccine. Yes. Your, your parents delayed the, the vaccination? I'm not sure. I've never asked. Uh, maybe <laughs> <laughs> I need uh -huh. to go and find out <laughs> what really happened. Uh -huh. Did I get the jab or did I not get the jab? Mm. But, uh, well, it happened. It happened, and yes. I'm here. Mm, and you're here now. And above all, I'm happy. Yes, that, I mean, that, and, and that's what make, you know, fascinates me about yes. you, that you don't, uh, you, you don't cry about it you have you have made it into a strength you know and it has become who you are as an individual yes instead of being somewhere on the street saying you know help me you have owned your story yes i mean you are a team leader at safaricom call center thank you could you could you just maybe tell us a little bit about what uh, what you do at safaricom um uh, maybe my journey at safaricom mm -hmm. i started uh, i've been there now for and we're heading to 12 years 12 years yes that's quite a while uh yeah, and i started like uh, what we call a uh, a customer care representative, mm -hmm. a Jambo. My name is Anthony. How may I assist you? Maybe at some point I served you. Oh, okay. And then from there I went to the support, uh, uh, which is the back end. Uh -huh. I've also been in quality assurance and currently I'm a team leader. What does team leader mean? Mm -hmm. It means that uh, I'm in charge of some of the people mm -hmm. within the call center. When you call, mm -hmm. like 100, 200, 234, mm -hmm. uh, 15 of some of those people that you talk to mm -hmm. report directly to me. 15 so, of those people we, we uh, talk to on those numbers yes. report to you? Yes. So ah, okay. Now, if someone in just does not talk to me nicely on Safaricom, <laughs> yes. I'll tell them, you know I know Anthony Moradi. <laughs> <laughs> I know your boss. Uh, I'm going to get you fired. <laughs> all right, all right. Yes. So since when have you been the team leader now? Uh, no, this is my, uh, I'm now in my second year. Second year. Yes, I'm uh, second year. How is it? It's it, fun? It's good. It's, it's fun. It's good. It's huh? uh, about dealing with people. Mm -hmm. uh, you get uh, uh, members who are, uh, who are different mm. and you have to handle them. And, mm -hmm. uh, you know, and but the, my greatest joy is mm -hmm. uh, when I see people are coming to the company mm. uh, and, and new, mm -hmm. you know, new, they have just joined. They are so green 
and then through my uh, uh, in my team mm -hmm. and I am able to grow them and okay. see them you know move from one point to the next to another that is that, my, that just is, is my is, it's one of those mm -hmm. good moments that I enjoy mm -hmm. so it, it's good it's, it's a good experience oh yes now let's go back to this topic you are talking about living with this ability yes. which is a, we are playing the words disability but with this ability yes now I, I, I would guess, just like for anybody else, yes. there have been some low moments, of but course. for you particularly because of this particular disability. Could you share with us maybe what were those particular low moments when you were growing up yes. yeah, that uh, might have happened to you or you have experienced? Um, uh, in the initial part of growing up uh, as a uh, child with a disability, mm -hmm. um, uh, one of those moments I did not like is when guests used to come home mm -hmm. and then uh, they would look at me and you know they would start asking my parents oh what happened to him mm. and then you know there was a, a, an expression they usually said oh, you know, oh that, like, a pity that thing Click. used to kill me uh, uh, yeah. there, so it used to kill me and so at some point I, I used to hide when uh, guests came to mm, our place mm, because mm. I did not want that mm -hmm. but then after I, I went to primary school mm. I found ah the other people mm. who have uh, uh, other disabilities, mm. and I felt like uh, I'm not alone. Mm. So mm. from there, I started speaking the pieces. Mm. But stigma is, let me say, is one of the biggest or the the, the biggest challenge. And this I've stigma, had. oftentimes, is not because of a point of hatred, but misplaced sympathy, mis pity yes, of uh -huh. some sort. Yes, of some sort. Or yes. or what so we've been brought up to think, mm. you know, uh, um, a misconceptions about mm -hmm. people with disabilities. Mm. For example, well, well, like for example, when I'm walking in town, sometimes, mm. sometimes uh, you know, I, I'm just there doing my own business. Mm. Uh, and and you know, somebody just comes offers maybe five shillings, mm. ten shillings, aye, aye, and aye, it's aye. in a hurry. But the worst is, uh, so you're just you're just doing your business in town, yes. And someone walks up to you and starts giving you charity. Uh, yeah, yeah, charity. <laughs> oh. Somebody has described that some people see uh, uh, people with disabilities as objects of charity, yeah. but you want to feel a bit th philanthropic. Mm. You just uh, dip the hand in the pocket and get a few coins. But but that's not uh, uh, the worst. I think I have I've had so many challenges, mm. but one one of them that was really really touching is when. Uh, I was using the matatus, maybe by asking me what do I use mm. nowadays. But when I was using my uh, matatus... <laughs> what do you do you use nowadays? <laughs> I drive myself. You drive yourself. Yes. That's a conversation I want us to have. Still, <laughs> see right now. Yes. There, there are many f accomplishments you have done. And I know, I, I think it's it's amazing. But yeah, go on with your story first. Uh, mm. So uh, this These days you're using matatus. Those days, huh? <laughs> yeah, those days. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. When I was old. <laughs> nowadays I'm young. <laughs> I uh, hear you. So I, I, I wanted to, I was going to work. Mm -hmm. I just uh, joined Safaricom. Mm -hmm. And then I got into a matatu. Uh, the way I used to do, to do it as my wheelchair, you know the matatus the way they have. Mm -hmm. The boots are small, or if the boots are big, they have big, huge music systems. Yeah. So what I used to do is uh, I get my wheelchair, then it is folded, then I squat on the seat behind the driver. This is the 14 seaters, so that I don't pay double fare. Because at that time I was still tamaking and maybe I was still young in the job. So there's this matter we're going to do, uh, number 23, going to Kangemi. <laughs> uh, and uh, when the driver came in, because I got in, the Makango was p telling people to come in. When the driver came in and start, wanted to drive, he looked back and he saw me. Then he asked the, uh, the, the Makanga. <laughs> Ninini hiu mebeba. You know, ninini hiu mebeba. Oh. Not ninani huyu. Sasa hii ninini umebeba. Sasa customers wataza kusema, eh, aje, this, uh, this thing is going to, uh, to, to identify the, 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 the other passengers. It was so hard. And he was so furious that the Makanga had carried this thing. And who was that thing? Moridi Anthony and his wheelchair. It was so bad, I had to get off the matatu, uh, pick a taxi. But I said... I told myself, of course, humanly speaking, you feel so bad. Absolutely. But I picked the pieces and I said, I think what that driver is saying, in other words, Morid, you're too special to be traveling in a matatu. You need to buy your own car. That's one of the things that inspired me into that. Amazing. That's a, yeah. Wow. That's, I mean, that's really, really great. It is, among so, other things. Among other things. Yes, I know, like another one, maybe a quick one. Uh, I, there's a uh, time I met with somebody. Yeah. Uh, I, I was crossing Uhuru Highway. Then there was this martel. Uh, smartly dressed man. He came, looked at me. I was waiting for the uh, traffic to clear. He looked at me and he said on my face, I hate these disabled people. And he went. Right in your yes. face. The wow. reason why he hates them, I don't know. But the question is, if he can say that in public, in the, uh, the, uh, uh, broad daylight, mm -hmm. how about if we met in Adaka? In, in Adaka, Ali, Maybe Ali, yes, yes. For You know, the, w when you mention that, sometimes I wonder, is it is it because partly some of, some of our cultures view disability as something from the devil or some form of punishment or 
uh, to an extent, yes. Some cultures, you remember, uh, the, the disability was a, like a form of curse, uh, you know, a curse uh, to that family, mm. or a form of punishment. And you know, we, uh, like when I interact with, I've interacted with quite a number of people, mm -hmm. and you know, they have different stories about how people with disabilities or children who are born with disabilities in their culture, what used to happen. Yeah. Some of them used to be thrown into the forest, mm -hmm. they are eaten by the hyenas, mm -hmm. others used to be hidden, mm -hmm. others used to be, you know, done all manner of uh, things. That is to be shown that you are not part of the human race. In, in other words, that you yeah. are one of the uh, biggest mistakes that mm. may have happened, you know, into a family. But I thank God that my family picked it and they said, this is one of our children and we're going to do the very best mm. to ensure that, uh, that that he gets the best. And I so, absolutely hope that our viewers watching you and listening to you can be people who can influence the community, you know, yes. immediate uh, around them to, to realize that this is, as, you, as that uh, driver said, this is not a thing. Yes. Or to, to allow these heads to go away and realize that uh, we are all equal, you know. Yes. Uh, disabled does not mean unequal, you know. That is, that is, should not, should not be, should not be the case. Wow. It should it, it should it at all. So, and I like the, mm. the title that you've given the show today, mm -hmm. this ability, instead of this ability. Mm. I don't know, you know, when I talk to people, mm -hmm. I tell them, you know, if you look at the word disability, you can decide to look at the broad word. Yeah. D I S A B B I L mm, I T Y. Mm. But if you if you remove the, the three uh, the first three letters, what mm. you get ability. Ability. Yes. So it is up to us. What do you want? Do you want to focus with the on the big one, yeah. or do you mm. want to focus on the mm. ability, mm. which is within mm. the bigger mm. one? Like so someone can be fully uh, you can you can be physically with all the uh, everything working but you you're not you're not doing well in life either way whether maybe mentally emotionally yes. and you can be physically challenged but doing pretty well uh, you know yes. I mean like, like you know I'm sure there are men who are physically able right yes. if you could if you could use that word yes. but they're still struggling to get married uh, but you are married you have two children three one, now one. Oh, 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 one. Yes. Oh, I thought there is another one no, no, but how no, is the boy doing ah, he's doing very well doing uh, well. maybe uh. we were to come with him today but uh -huh. uh, uh, he's feeling a bit unwell mm -hmm. Uh, his name is Emmanuel. Yes, Emmanuel. Morin, yeah, Emmanuel. Now, correct. He's now two years and uh, about seven months. I'm sure he he's watching. He's watching. And maybe saying, Baba, Baba, yeah, Baba, Baba, is on Baba. TV. Baba is on TV. <laughs> hey, uh, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, uh, Emmanuel, <laughs> Dad. Moremi. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 oh, Emmanuel Moremi, right? Yes, yeah, that's his name. Emmanuel Moremi, <laughs> proud of your dad. And your wife is also definitely watching. Yes, I'm mm. sure. My wife is also watching. What's her name? Her name is Jacinta Mosenya. Jacinta Mosenya. Yes. Now, I want to hear that story also. Yes. How, how did... How, how did you get to fall in love? When you were here last time, it, you, you shared with us falling in love was not a walk in the park for you. True. Could you just tell us, I mean, uh, the, the journey to falling in love with Jacinta? Oh, uh, the journey to falling in love with Jacinta was after I had I was heartbroken mm -hmm. uh, 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 previously. And like all men, yeah, sure. of course, mm. I, I've taken several ladies out, mm -hmm. bought them coffee, uh -huh, mm. and you know all that. Uh, yes, yes. But then how did it happen with Jacinta? Uh, we were... Uh, we met in town uh, mm -hmm. doing our own uh, hassles. Here in Nairobi, right? Yes, here uh -huh. in Nairobi. Uh -huh. And uh, I looked at her and saw that uh, she was somebody mm. who was hardworking. Mm. Uh, just to say it. Uh, we were, we but don't tell me that's the first thing that attracted you. She's no, hardworking. Of course, uh, of course. Of course. Of course. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah. And <laughs> then uh, we started communicating. Mm. We're, like, what we are, we are doing is that we're in the same, you know, this networking, maybe a network marketing business. No, network. Ne so she uh, joined yeah. my network. Yeah. And as I was communicating to people in my network, I noted one thing that she's one of the few people who are responding to my communication. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Every time I send something, she had to say something. So then I saw, oh, okay. Then I went to her Facebook. I mm. picked uh, I picked her uh, 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 nanny. I befriended her. Mm -hmm. And then we started chatting. Yeah, I can see there's a picture of you actually on your on your wedding, first of all. Mm -hmm. wait, wait for it, wait for it. Let's first of all, so you started chatting. Wait, we are, we're going to see that picture in a few. So you started chatting with Jacinta. Yes. Mm -hmm. Then uh, after that, uh, uh, I remember I uh, would call her and we'd talk for qu quite a long time, mm -hmm. just sharing. But one thing that really endeared, other than the habit, of course, mm. and by the way, for the viewers, she's a person without disability. You know, sometimes people think that a person with a disability can only get a, a, a person a, a, with a, a yeah, disability. Yeah, yeah, correct, she correct. doesn't have a disability. Mm. But um, among other things that I, I endeared me to her is that she's hardworking, and at no particular time did she look, in quotes, at my pocket. She did not focus on the, my pocket. 
she, you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure, she sure. Was not, uh, That's bold. the disability that. Um, uh, yes, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, but, for her, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, but for her, she focused more on you know uh, just the person, uh, uh, the uh, Boridian. And uh, uh, then I remember our first date. We uh, went to Chamuilo. Uh, there's, a, it's a, there's a certain hill in Ukambani. Chamuilo. Uh, yes. Uh -huh. There's a certain hill in Ukambani uh -huh. where there's no gravity. Mm. You know, if you pour water, it goes uphill. Okay, uh, uh, yes. Have you ni kamotesio? <laughs> <laughs> Sing gravity, eh? Yeah? It's yeah, gravity. Yeah. Yeah. So that's I remember that was uh, our first date, and uh, then from there mm. we started dating, started talking, um, and, and as they say, the rest is history. But I know I mm. remember mm. one thing I told her, mm -hmm. which is a fact is that uh, when uh, you have to make your own decision, uh, the moment you make a decision to get married to Marie, uh, Anthony, who has a disability, mm. people will question. Mm. People will ask you whether you did not have choices another choice and uh, so she was ready she was ready for yes, that she, she she got prepared and she was ready but was there some like blowback against her when you talk was there some blowback some uh, some of what you want her did it happen f from any side she told me from uh, some friends uh, 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 questioned uh, you know they were like uh, not directly but mm. you know like uh, uh, are you sure is this what you want? Mm. But for her, she had, she had made up her mind. Yeah. And uh, but even from her family, the f the support was superb. Absolutely. Well, the one thing I came to learn that is that the moment you are, you say this is my choice, mm. sometimes even the family don't mm. have much choice. Mm. They Absolutely. Have to go with their yeah. choice. Let, let's let's see let's see some of the pictures before we continue with the conversation. Mm -hmm. Maybe you could maybe uh, these pictures could be enlarged so that we can see them uh, more. Yeah, yeah, we can start with ah, that one. That one. Okay. Ah, yes, this is uh, you and your wife. Oh, yes. yeah, she's quite quite something, you know. Yeah. She, she's uh, uh, she, she's uh, quite a beauty. Yeah. <laughs> that is the, uh, our wedding day. Oh, uh, 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 these are I think he's picking them from uh, yeah. uh, Facebook. Go go, go back go back go back to the selection. Go back to the selection. Let's see what we have. Uh, yeah. uh, another one. Uh, go back to the selection of the of the photos. The photos. Yes. Close that one. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Then go. Uh, maybe this one. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You can see this one here. Yes. There's also that one. There's also that another so, one. The next there before we got married. Ah. Uh, okay. Uh, so select the one above here. Yeah. Here. Yes. Even that one. Even that even one that is one okay. That's also good. Where? Okay. Right there. Yes. Yeah. Click on that. So. Oh yeah, this is yes, yeah. that was uh, before the wedding. Uh huh. That's uh, what, what if we may put it in a, a language that bad we can amkatia. Oh, look up on a jerry to mingi box. Eh, we can box. Awesome, awesome. Uh huh. That's we can go bunch. back. Uh, which one else? Any other one? No. This one. I I like this one. This well, one you're in one shades, I, man. Uh, the one I'm in shades. Yeah, you look. Uh, oh. Huh? Oh, wow. My uh, nigga. I like yeah. You? Huh? <laughs> All right, FBI. FBI. <laughs> I see you. With the night vision goggles. <laughs> okay, <laughs> the, let's. The feature is bright. Uh -huh. Yeah, it is very bright. You need to wear goggles. Uh, very very I, bright. I, I uh, All right. Uh, is, there, is there another one that you've got uh, I don't that you think want I to? Have another one, maybe. Uh -huh. Uh, Maybe uh, we, we, we can go up. We can go up to the one that you with Jacinta. Yes. We can go up right here. Yes, there, this one. one. Ah. Uh, this uh, one right here, one. right here. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Click on that one. I mean, uh, good. It's, it's an amazing picture. That's, uh, yes. So after you got married, now you you you, you got a son and uh, yes, as you said, uh, uh, Emmanuel, right? Emmanuel. That yeah. was mm. born on twenty third of uh, August, mm -hmm. uh, twenty. Uh, 16. 2016. Bouncing baby boy. Bouncing 4. baby boy. 0.02 kgs. Awesome. Jamal and Gufu. Awesome. We're going to take a break right now. We're going to we, we, we'll resume this conversation with uh, Anthony. Anthony, as I mentioned to you, Anthony Moradi is the uh, team leader at uh, Safaricom Call Center, as he mentioned to you. And But right now, we're going to take a short break. Remember to go to our Facebook page, Y254, and comment your suggestion, uh, opinion, or questions to Anthony or um, Ian Msani, you want to pass something, please do that. We'd like to hear from you. What do you think about this conversation? What do you think about what Anthony Moredi is inspiring us today? I would love to be to read your comments. So right now I'm gonna give it back to Ian Msani. Let's go. All righty. Getting ready for our future life, future life, future life. Get easy to cut it. Now 
friends and family, we have a good time. Good time. But I Honeymoon to tafikiria To learn you one thing to kufura here Let me tell you something, my dear Leo tunapati kwa nduthi after he tunachafua Delson mi nitanunua Bada enda kuimbia Wanajua mini fire I say today You are going to be my wife. I say today, today, today. You are going to be my wife. Na se male, ni le, ole. Ah, ole ni wangu. Na se male, ni le, ole. Ah, ole ni wangu. Na. Niki check check boys wangu wako rada No stress a leo ina tupamba I mean now we, now we Only live once ye Chapati dondo leo tunamanga Hapo kando kwa bezi tatubamba I mean now we, now we Honey moon tutafikiria To learn you one thing to kufura here Let me tell you something my dear Leo tunapati kwa nduthi after he tunachafua Delson mi nitanunua Bada enda kuimbia Wanajua minifaya I say today 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 You are going to be my wife I say today 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 You are going to be my wife Na se male Only live once, now say mami, now we, now we, we, me, now we, now we, we, me, now we, now we, only live once, yeah. Want me to give I mean this is so good you want me to give you one more <laughs> it's okay we can do one more you have one more yeah okay let's go, go go for okay, it I mean I'm enjoying this let's do Chorea mtani Juicy na form Wali ni chorea Ni katamani sana To achieve my dreams And have a good life Ni rock easy stages By can I Live my life Ndiyo ni kandi ka fire For kilasho ni Lester Penn Tole sing along Ni ka release bamba pia Ikawa anthem kwa street Tole bounce along Lazima tutatana Nisha come through Washa light kwenye giza Lazima kutapana pia ye Basi tell your crew Mr. Fire mesha pika Jurada ni safe Tona sing along Tona sing along Rada ni safe Tuli dance a yada Now we dance a bro Rada ni safe Tona sing along Tona sing along Rada ni safe Tuli dance a yada Now we dance a bro Ama dare, ama pango, kilele shwa Ama dando, runda, ama mlango Hapo karen, ama sivo Kutoka geto maka ubabini Dreams have validoji amini K 
kila siku twende kazini wakiuliza eti ni kwa nini washo rada si safe ukibeba ganu naibia maskini kama we na rada si safe ukipe wa talanta na mshawe hauchezi kama we lazima tutatana yeye nisha kamtungu washa life kwenye giza lazima kutabana wewe basi tendia crew Mr. Fire me shafi kajurada ni safe yeah yeah tuna sing along tuna sing along rada ni safe tuli dance yard na we dance bro rada ni safe tuna sing along tuna sing along rada ni safe tuli dance yard na we dance bro kutoka ghetto mpaka ubapini form ni kucheza na rada dreams iko vale basi cheza na rada kutoka ghetto mpaka ubapini form ni kucheza na rada dreams iko vale basi cheza na rada Rada ni safe tuna sing along tuna sing along Rada ni safe to lead and say yard now we dance a bro Rada ni safe wewe tuna sing along tuna sing along Rada ni safe yeah yeah to lead and say yard now we dance a bro Fam And we are back and we are back with uh, from uh, not from with Ian Musani, we're back. And I hope you're commenting and uh, you're enjoying. Four songs. I've given you one extra from Ian Musani. You should pay me. This is a free performance from Ian Musani. And I'm sure by the way, he said he has a song, a wedding song. So if you're getting married, by the way, there's a band to call. They don't charge so much, just 100,000. All right, I mean, not so, not so highly. All right, so welcome back as we continue this conversation with Living With This Ability. And um, uh, my guest today is Anthony Murray, the team leader at Safaricom Call Center. And he's sharing with us his beautiful story about how he's married, he's got a son, uh, Emmanuel. Yeah, Emmanuel, shout out to you, and Jacinta, shout out to you, and congratulations for finding this fine gentleman to, uh, to marry and bring him so much joy. So now, Mr. Moravi, you know, one thing that's fascinating uh, about you is you drive. Yes. How do you, how, how do you drive? I mean, I'm sure that's a question. How, how do you drive? How? Uh -huh. <laughs> How is the question? And, yes. Uh, Before you, you go back to how you got the car, yes. first of all, I'm interested. How do you drive? Uh, first of all, I drive what we call a normal automatic car. A normal automatic Just car. Just a normal automatic car. Uh -huh. uh, if you look at me, mm -hmm. I have the left hand that mm -hmm. is strong mm -hmm. and the right hand that is not strong. Mm -hmm. My uh, left leg is not as strong, mm -hmm. but uh, right leg is a bit stronger. Okay, okay. So what I do is that, the, uh, you know, the, the, an automatic car yes, has yes. only the uh, accelerator and the brake. Yeah. So that work is done by the uh, your, right leg. Your right leg, yes. Mm. And then the left does all the hand the, the steering. Kabisa unachika hivi. Uko salama. Kabisa. Southern Vipers, 110 kilometers per hour. Uko salama. Oh, yes. Wow. Yes. I so mean, that's, many, uh, people, many uh. people don't understand how it works, but that's how it is. Because what I understand is sometimes the, the car can be modified. Yes. Uh, according to the disability you have true but yours is no modification at all yes and uh, i know i know that that's one of the issues i have i had because for people with disabilities mm. we are usually tax exempted yes for, for, mm. for such mm. things mm. and one of the requirements is that the car has to be modified now for for a car that is modified it means that i all the controls come to the hands yes so the condition is both hands must be working working yeah now i have only one that one that hand that is working so, so what yeah. i usually tell mm. people is mm. instead of the car being modified for me mm. i am modified for the car you're modified <laughs> you are modified for the car i am modified for the car <laughs> that's, that's that's really good yeah so that's such that now my, uh. my right leg uh. how long have you been driving um my own car is now eight years eight years now but since i started mm. driving uh, it's about uh, eight plus three eleven mm. years eleven years now yes. Yes. you know that's uh, you I mean your inspiration all around. Married, you're driving. You have you know you have a job. 
you're, you're, you're contributing, you're happy. I mean, this is, this is great. And you studied at the University of Nairobi, right? Yes, I did. That's where you were a student. Yes. What did you do there? Uh, I was at the main campus, uh -huh. and I took a Bachelor of Arts degree in Sociology and Economics. Okay. Yes, and of course, I graduated in the year 2001. Mm -hmm. and that day, I was given the power to do all Power that to read. Uh, to read and uh, do all that appertains to the degree. Absolutely. <laughs> and, uh, yes. the, and when you were in the University of Nairobi, one of the things that you mentioned to us is you... You are a health beneficiary at that uh, yes, time, yes, I did. and uh, you used to save the money that you that was supposed for you to be for your living expenses. Oh uh, well, yeah. oh, what, what, what was that story? I didn't get it so well. Tell me about it. Oh, uh, okay, of course. Uh, I had you giving this story, but it was not so clear. <laughs> it but was, it uh, wasn't very clear. Yeah. Um, okay, I, I used to get the uh, help loan uh -huh. uh, and also the bursary mm. uh, because I come from a what you call humble background. Yeah. So uh, for me. Uh, the help loan was really a big boost. Mm. Uh, I, I tried as much as possible to to, to do some savings here and there, mm -hmm. uh, but uh, by the time I was clearing, I didn't have much. Mm -hmm. uh, but you know, I was able to gather one or two things that uh, you know uh, for my own upkeep. Mm -hmm. uh, and after, after graduating in those days, we to go to Nanza Kazi. Mm. Yeah, kutafuta kazi. Kazi ya kutafuta kazi. So, yeah, so ah. I, I was able to survive uh, for the, those uh, four and a half years that I was looking for uh, for a job. For four and a half years yes. you were looking for a job? Yes, of course. The little savings that I had mm. ran out. This is the time you're meeting the rude driver? Uh, yes, that's the time. And this is the time you're meeting this guy who doesn't ha who says he hates... Uh, yes, th those are the moments. Wow. And so many other, other things. Yeah. But that did not really deter me. Mm -hmm. I was determined. Mm -hmm. And I forged forward. I remember that it's also during that time when the uh, the car that I I, I, I said uh, I drive, mm. uh, which I said I told myself this is going to be my first car. Mm. I saw it, and at that time I didn't have anything. Mm -hmm. But I, whenever I saw it on the street, I said, "This is my car. I want this to drive that car." car. Uh, and, uh. and so I I, I kept moving. Mm, I, kept I, mm. I, I never gave up. Mm. I got a lot of support from my brothers, from mm -hmm. my sister, from friends. If uh, friends that we were with at the university mm. until now, I was able to get a job, mm. and uh, now I'm where I am. And and we are we we are we are happy for you. I mean, good for you. You know, for where you are. Thank you. Now there is one question that someone might ask you. Yes. Faced with all this, you yes. come from a humble background, yes. which literally means poor. Let's let's yes, talk let's about it. it. Yeah. Yes. And uh, you you have this particular disability, which I mean, there, it's a roadblock on top of another one, right? Yes. yes. What kept you moving? What kept you? What prevented you from saying, you know what, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm done trying, yes. you know, I'm going to sit down somewhere yes. and be a charity case? Oh, the one thing that I, I wanted to prove a point, mm -hmm. that I wanted to prove to those people who are saying that uh, Muridi can't make it, Muridi is a, a disabled, he's not able, I wanted to prove a point. Mm -hmm. uh, and I wanted uh, to prove that regardless of your state in life, what matters is what do you tell yourself, mm. not what do people say about you. Yes. People may say all manner of things. Unfortunately, mm, mm. we don't have control of what people say yes, or yes. think Absolutely. about us. Yeah. But there is one thing that I'm happy about, that as an individual, you have 100% control of how to react. Mm. So the question is, how do you react? Uh, what do you tell yourself? Mm, so mm. I was telling myself that uh, this is what they think about me. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Mm. That's their opinion. That's, the, that, that's what they think about me. But what do I, th I think about myself? And I was telling myself that, Muridi, you're a great man. You're going to be a successful person. And you are. And, and people are going to look, uh, you're going to be an inspiration uh, to someone. Again, and of you course, are. Uh, yeah, and, mm. uh, thank you. Mm. And I'm, of course, I'm a Christian, so mm. I also drew a lot of inspiration and uh, comfort from the Bible. Absolutely. And especially the story of the blind man mm -hmm. who, uh, people, uh, who people brought to Jesus. Mm -hmm. And people, uh, the disciples were asking, who sinned for this man to be born blind? Is mm -hmm. it him or the parents? And mm -hmm. Jesus said, none of them. Mm -hmm. He's like that. So that the name of God may be glorified. Be glorified. Mm -hmm. So um, I also say, I'm like this, so that the name of God may be glorified. glorified. And by the way, uh -huh. I'm a Sunday school teacher. Ooh, you're a Sunday school teacher. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, St. Paul's, right? Yes, the St. Paul's. Now, you, you know, there is the, that point you have. Before I even ask you this point, I want to encourage our viewers to go to our Facebook page, Y254 channel. There are pictures posted about our conversation that we are having here. Go to our Facebook page. And as I mentioned to you, comment there, ask a question, say something to Anthony Muradi or say something to Ian Msani. Our Facebook page is Y254. And we'd like to hear from you. All right. So go there, do that. I'm going to be reading you out in a, in a bit. You said, you know, you, you brought this, the, the, this story about that 
I am this way so that God's name might be glorified. Yes. Now someone might ask, what kind of God mm -hmm. gives a person disability yes. so that he might be glorified? I mean... Oh, <laughs> good one. Good, good question. One. Ah. That's a good question. Uh -huh. And uh, it's one of the things that I struggled with as I was growing up. Mm -hmm. That uh, if really God is a loving God, why did he give me legs, as we put them, like mm -hmm. other people? Mm -hmm. Why did, uh, did he have to create me or make me be on a wheelchair. Mm. But I realize that God gives us different things for different purposes. So, uh, and my, 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 my thinking was, and uh, what my conclusion was after reading all that is that God uh, allowed me to be this way so that I may become a vessel of demystifying disability, mm. giving mm. hope to mm -hmm. even people who are living with disability. Absolutely. And also giving people, uh, hope to those people who are without disabilities, but who feel they are worse off. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. you know, sometimes I ask uh, people, well, I'm a, a motivational speaker. Yes, when yes. I go to uh, motivate people, I ask them, for those, if when you sit down and you say you can't, and I ask them this question, if today you are not like Maurice the Anthony, mm -hmm. whose right hand is, that, is this way, mm -hmm. so if, if your right hand is not like this, if today your two legs are able to support you, if today, you can be able to go upstairs without assistance. Mm -hmm. And like Moridio Antony was be carried upstairs. What excuse do you have, you know, to sit back and say that I can't? Mm -hmm. Yes. So that's the, big, that's the big question. Wow. So, so I think mm -hmm. God made me that so that I can be asking people. To so, challenge people, to, to, challenge people to, to be so. grateful for what they yes, have. I think, grateful, yes. I, I think that would be, a, you know, someone seeing you, if anything that can come from their heart is a sense of gratitude that, wow, if Anthony can do all that, mm -hmm. Uh, with this disability, with this ability, if you, as you are saying, yes. then I should be able to, you know, do, do even, even more, much, you know, and even do much more. more. Yeah, that, absolutely. Yes. So, you know, my final question in, in this regard now, we have talked about uh, you, you know, you being inspiration and all that, yes. and you finding, you know, the grace of God in, uh, in your experience. Yes. And now, uh, you have a, a son, right? Yes. And uh, you have a family. Yes. And uh, this becomes your social support, if I could say. Yes. How important is someone who with a certain disability to have social support? How important is it? Simply put, very, very, very important. I usually say that uh, the fact that I've been able to come mm. is because I got a lot of support mm -hmm. from home, mm. from my parents, mm. from the siblings, that when, they, when I went out there, where, yeah. you know, outside home, and the world was harsh to me. Mm -hmm. I would still uh, have, I had a place where I could fall back and find people who are saying, this is still one of us, this is still our son, mm. this is still our brother, mm -hmm. this is, is still our, you know, a, 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 a one of us. And, and I, I like the way my parents uh, uh, brought me up. They were not so woye for me. No, I'm the firstborn, whether, and, and I had to be an example. And I remember even sometimes being caned. In fact, I was being caned. Whenever I, I, I did something wrong, I had to be caned. Whether I'm crawling on the ground or what, I had to be caned. And, uh, and the question they were asking me, what picture are you, or, or rather, what example are you showing to yeah. your brothers and sisters? Mm. You're the firstborn. Whether you're, you, you, that's your, your title, that's your position. You need to show good example. Yeah. And I think uh, that, that really, really, really uh, brought me to be the person that I am today. So that social support mm. is very, very, very important. Very essential. Uh, along my life, I've seen people who were both rejected. But by the way, this is something that happens. Some people are rejected even at home because of a disability. Like we said, in some cultures, people think a person with a disability yeah, is correct. a curse. Mm. So if it, this person is a curse, is a bad woman, then we, we need to get rid of the person. So you can imagine if a person who gets out of, is rejected in, from the family and then goes out there and is rejected by the world. That person, I've seen some of my brothers and sisters with disabilities committing suicide because of that. And it's a sad, that's, a, that's absolutely sad. Yes. So people need to be accepting of people living with disability. Yes. And on the, side, on the other side, they should avoid the woye attitude. That's what you're saying. Yes. The pity. They, they need to have what you call tough love. Tough love. Yes, it mm -hmm. is tough, but it's love. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you are loving. You, know, mm -hmm. you, do, you need to let the person know that. Mm -hmm. Regardless of this, then this is expected of you. Absolutely. So, yes, so the, but the woye attitude uh, sometimes doesn't, uh, it makes a person become just there. Ah, yeah, ah, yeah. And mm -hmm. everything that comes is just is the person. Yeah. But so they need to show up love mm -hmm. and they need to support them uh, in the best way possible. Absolutely. Well, what we call uh, reasonable accommodation. 
even in workplaces, even the environment, even everywhere. Mm. We, 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 as a society, we need to do what we call a reasonable accommodation for people mm. uh, living with disabilities. Uh -huh. Why reasonable? Uh -huh. Because some uh -huh. of us, uh, people with disabilities, we want to get everything to be done for us, you know, because I, I need this, because I'm positive. No. We, we know we have to get, we have to be reasonably accommodated without disadvantaging other mm, people. Other people. Yes. Oh, that's, that's a good point. It's a good point at least coming also from you, you know. So, so Anthony Moridi, I'm humbled that you, are, you, you accept to come to my show. I'm, I really appreciate. Appreciate uh, you. Thank you for sharing with us your story. I don't know if you, maybe you look at that camera and maybe pass a few words of how we can be, uh, promote a culture of inclusivity. Um, what I can say is that to promote a culture of uh, inclusivity, what we need to do is just to uh, to see uh, persons. Ca I'm sorry. told it's, it's camera. Yes. Sorry. Yes. Ah, uh, sorry. This one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so uh, to promote a culture of inclusivity, what we need to do uh, and to understand is that disability is not a choice. Anybody and everybody is a candidate of disability. Meaning that uh, instead of looking at disabilities as other people's issue, let us embrace it. Because today I could be working and we have seen uh, some cases, and uh, something happens the following day, a person is on, uh, uh, gets a disability. But the question is, does life stop? No. Does that person become useless? No. So we need to embrace uh, and include them uh, and uh, reasonably uh, within the systems. We need to be conscious of uh, that we have people who are living with disabilities when we are coming up with the structures when we are coming up with programs when we are coming up with policies let's also remember that we have people who are able to differently or we're living with disabilities and today it's them and tomorrow it could be you so let's all love each other accommodate each other because even for the person with a disability there is an ability in disability Awesome. I love that. Thank you so much, Mr. Anthony Moredi, team leader, Safaricom uh, call center. It has been an amazing uh, conversation with Mr. Anthony, and uh, I hope you have enjoyed this conversation. I'm going to give it back to uh, Mr. Um, uh, I'm going to give it to Ian Msani and the band to give us their final performance. And if there are some comments that you have sent in, I'll be reading them. But for now, thank you so much for being part of this conversation, and I hope that you'll be spreading that love and uh, acceptance to people living with disability, and that you will show them that they have an ability and you'll not fall in that trap of the way or you know excluding them let's make kenya more inclusive in our workplaces in our universities in our schools in our hospitals that everyone feels part of the family and so spread the love you know be mad be exceptional make a difference and i'll see you next time good night Kwetu vijana, sisi vijana. Kwetu vijana, sisi vijana. Kwetu vijana, knowledge is power. Let's be enlightened to so many sana. Nasio za kulevia. Dawa, so many fallen soldiers Ju ya life ya utegi Gimta tunangoja Because we want so many changes Here and there, crime everywhere Let's show some care to our siblings out here And learn to live together to the song Gambe, lele, 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 tukibonga moba Bila action zote nige, lele, 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 lele atuta <laughs> Tunawacha to take action, yeah, eh, eh, yeah, eh, eh, yeah. Atu songi mbele, yeah, eh, eh, yeah, eh, eh, yeah. Tunarudi nyuma tuta songa mbele, le, 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 tukiponga moba. Bila action zote nike, le, 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 le. Atu ta songa mbele, le, 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 tukiponga moba. Bila action zote nike, le, 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 le. 
Atuta songa mbelele lele lele tukibonga mamba bila action zote ni gelele lele lele Atuta songa mbelele lele 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 Atuta songa mbelele lele 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 Take it away baraka Bila action zote ni kelele lele lele Atuta songa mbe lele 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 Kibonga mumba Bila action zote ni kelele lele 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 Atuta songa mbe lele 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 Kibonga mumba Bila action zote ni kelele lele 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 Ian Msani and the band, that's amazing songs right there and uh, I've loved every minute of it. Thank you so much Ian Msani. Even as I read the comments, I just want to say that has been beautiful. Huh? Thank you so much. All right. Uh, okay, okay. I'm, I'm told so that I can be able to be heard. All right, perfect. Uh, Zoe Patricia, I'm watching. Um, now I'm reading the comments from Facebook that you have sent in, even though I had said goodbye. But I want to. I don't. I want to show you that I have noticed your comments. There is Zoe Patricia saying, "I'm watching and I'm so and so much encouraged. Anthony is such an inspiration and a great motivator. I am from Membu, just like him, and would like to wish, and I would wish to meet him one day." I'm also in the disability club. Uh, sorry, my phone just went off. How can one get his contact? It sure is a great show. Thank you so much, Zoe. Uh, would you like to pass on your, 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 uh, a way that uh, people can contact you, those who want to? Maybe they can uh, get, get, get in touch with me via, uh -huh. uh, via the, the, the Facebook. So Facebook page, someone can inbox you from yeah, there. Inbox me. Muridi Anthony. Yeah, Muridi Anthony. Okay. Muridi Anthony. Mm -hmm. Or they can also go to Instagram. I mean, uh, Twitter. Twitter, sorry. Mm. At Muridi Anthony also. At Muri Tony. M U R I. Tony. T O N I E. Muri Tony. Uh, yeah. T O N I E. Yes. Perfect. Thank you so much. I hope Zoe Patricia have heard of that. Muridi, there are two accounts. Muridi Anthony, you can. Text on both. He's going to respond to you. Then just for uh, Matt Musioka, you're always watching. And thank you for so much for that. Ian, big up. All right. And I'm watching from Konza. Moreidi has an amazing story. Thank you so much, just for Oscar Odhiambo. Hello, Ian. I'm Oscar Odhiambo. I'm watching you live from Kisi Town. I'm happy with your guest, Anthony Moreidi. And I want to tell... To tell that being disabled is God's plan. Okay, thank you, Oscar Odiambo. And also, I think he is also saying he is passing his regards to you, Ian, and your team. Keep lagat Jafan Chelem Gang Akia Nani Acero. All right, from Acero Village, Kabisaga Ward, Nandi County. Watching live, Kama Kawaida. Thank you so much, Keep lagat. Then we have Fatima Samir. Hello, naitwa Fatima kutoka Iringa, Tanzania, mimi mgeni. Wewe, yani unakuuliza, unatazamia kutoka Tanzania ama upo hapa Kenya? Hebu tueleze dadangu. Safi sana Fatima. Then kuna Liz Keshi. God, you so glorified no one compared to him. Thank you so much Liz uh, Keshi. Uh, now there is also Caribbean King saying, I like him. Now, I don't know if he likes Ian or he likes. <laughs> All right. So thank you so much for your comments. Keep them coming. And thank you for watching the Power Talk Show. And uh, it's been a wrap. God bless. Good night. See you sometime. Imagine.